Hello from Huga Health. Let's chat today about how red light therapy can offer relief for those who struggle with eczema. Eczema, known as atopic dermatitis, is a chronic skin condition that results in red, itchy, and inflamed skin that can be a daily struggle for many. In fact, it affects millions of people worldwide. Red light therapy uses specific wavelengths of red and near-infrared light to stimulate cellular activity in our body's tissues. These light wavelengths penetrate the skin and are absorbed by photoreceptors in our cells that then stimulate the mitochondria, the powerhouse of the cells, to boost the production of ATP, which is a molecule that's essential for cellular energy, function, and repair. Red light therapy increases blood circulation, reduces inflammation, and stimulates the production of collagen and elastin, which are essential for healthy skin. It also promotes the release of anti-inflammatory cytokines, calming the immune system response. In the studies done on red light therapy and eczema, the participants were found to have reduced itching and inflammation, leading to improved skin quality. There were also some studies done that showed red light therapy provided substantial relief for flare-ups. If you're interested in trying red light therapy for your eczema, here's what you need to know. You'll need about three to 15 joules per centimeter squared. This is all dependent on the severity of your eczema. For most of our panels, you'll want to stand 18 to 24 inches away from your device for five to 10 minutes to get in this range. The further away you are, the more time you should add. This is dependent on your device. Be sure to check out the irradiance of your device in its manual, and you can reference our dosage video, which I'll link below, if you'd like to calculate this yourself. It's recommended to initially start with red light therapy sessions two to three times per week, and then when you experience improvements, you can go down to one to two per week if you'd like, or just continue two to three times per week. Be sure to chat with your healthcare professional or dermatologist for more personalized recommendations to monitor your progress.